I'll make it come out right on my watch. Derby, the New York Derby. <laughs> I got Sean and Baker. The wire to the three eighths, I thought was the best part of the work. You know, once, okay. he, once he hit the wire and he kind of took off again. Yeah. Was yeah. that was was that by? Yeah, by design. Okay, that's good. Just because he needs to fit, you know, he needs to run. Oh well, yeah, I mean. All right, it's okay. Always, it's always good to finish up and work. I would imagine. You went the right pace early, so. You know. It's just, it just keeps him, it just keeps him where he's, he keeps him from getting too nervous, you know. It's good stamina and it's, it's not so fast to where it's going to get him all, you know, nervous. That's sort of something you've had to work on, right? I mean, he's been, since Florida, you mean, to navigate, you know. But he's been, he's been, uh, <coughs> he's been good. He's been a lot better than that. He was even good in Florida in the morning, but I don't know why he was so bad. I don't know. Anyway, I like the way he worked. Where you stand right now, I mean, how do you feel about your position right now? This one? Good, you know, good condition-wise. You know, like I said, a lot of things got to work out. He's got to handle a crowd. He's got to handle the track. He's got to handle all the other stuff that goes with it. So. But at least he's going there in a good frame of mind and in good condition. So, should you know? The one thing, if he was coming, if he, if he worked lackluster and was leaving his oats, and he still had to go there to run. That's you know, it's really the confidence goes down a lot. As far as how he's doing, I couldn't be happy. What's your now travel plan? We're gonna do like David Grenning said. <laughs> I didn't say I just did. I was just giving the post times. <laughs> no, but it was good, it was good advice. I'm glad you told me. You know, because now he's got a good work on himself. I was happy to get this out of the way. We could afford to uh, you know, we could afford to lose the day we're gonna lose shipping when we're when we're gonna ship. We're not gonna get there till early Sunday morning now. So that gives them all day to he can lounge a little bit if you want. We can get him out in the afternoon just to walk and take a look at the place, and then we can gallop on Monday morning. And uh, oh, maybe a blowout Thursday over there? Just yeah, the I think we'll probably just go down and go, go a quarter down the stretch. If he gallops out in 37 and change, that should be all he needs. But you know, it depends. He goes there and gallops faster one day than I thought. I might change your mind, but... He's been very, he's been pretty tractable lately, so, but that's the plan.